I'm here today to share with you how we develop large-scale luxury real estate developments and I've broken down what is actually a complex process into four stages. Hi, my name is Andrew and I'm a principal at Kona Development Partners, a private equity fund and real estate development firm based in Beverly Hills. To recap the stages, stage one is raising all necessary capital for infrastructure development through our own private equity fund. Stage two is overseeing and coordinating the development of the infrastructure and the amenities. Stage three is marketing, more on that in just a second, and stage four, sales. Uh, this Hawaii project will take us over the billion dollar mark in destination real estate sales over our 40 year track record. Check out part one, two, and four of this series of videos at our Invest in Kona YouTube channel for more details on those other stages. But in this video, we're going to concentrate on stage three, marketing. Without question, this is what separates us from most real estate developers and investors. Destination real estate itself, the way it is marketed to buyers and the way it is viewed by buyers is drastically different than any other sector of the real estate business. Now, I'm not going to go into every detail and lay out a specific how-to on our marketing program because I know it's one of the areas in which we have a definite edge over our competition. I will, however, outline the two main principles that guide us while creating and executing the program. Principle number one, there are no silver bullets, meaning there's never a single solution. An effective destination real estate marketing program is multifaceted and complex. In today's digital marketing space, it's called omni-channel marketing, meaning that every available channel and platform works together to create a unified message, voice, and brand for your company and product. Well, we were conducting omni-channel marketing before the internet or even the term omni-channel even existed. We rely on that proven and valuable experience from the past with traditional marketing methods and use them today to further support a robust omni-channel program that is currently being created in advance of launching our real estate pre-sales. Furthermore, because the digital space is a forever changing landscape, we've contracted leading firms to consult us in their areas of expertise to maximize the effectiveness and efficiency of the program. Principle number two, do not wait for your customer to come to you, go to your customer. Rather than sitting in Hawaii and waiting on our potential customer to come to us, we've already established a foothold in Southern California, which is one of our major markets. In addition to the office in Beverly Hills, from which I'm speaking to you now, we're opening satellite offices in other major markets as well. Our most recent project in Fiji has the same target markets as Hawaii, so we're leveraging that recent experience for the benefit of this project on the Kona Coast. Perfectly executed digital and even traditional marketing techniques will never create multi-million dollar destination real estate sales on their own. It will only create the introduction between the buyer and the seller. Human interaction early in the sales process will greatly increase the probability of a sale occurring. Having established a presence in areas that make us accessible to our potential clients will allow us to close a higher volume of real estate sales in less time, which for us and our partners translates into higher profit. If you're an accredited investor and would like to receive more information about partnering with us on our upcoming project on the Kona Coast of Hawaii, please click on the Learn More button below or any link in the description of this video and set up a time for us to speak one-on-one. -on -one. Again, my name is Andrew Rowland with Kona Development Partners and I look forward to speaking with you soon.